Hey everyone, Clark here, show you welcome back to another live, live stream. Uh, hey everyone, Clark here, show you welcome back to another video. Today I'm back, today we are back, and today um, I just want to talk about what's been happening recently and um, what I've been doing recently. And um, I've been recently been doing some investigation, as you can see. Um, recently I've been investigating on the sort of YouTube thing that's been going on right now. Um, basically what's been going on is basically um, YouTube tweeted out something saying how they could terminate channels if they're not making enough money but that's not the case eventually they did make a tweet which I will appear on the screen now uh, which they are saying uh, we're not uh, terminating accounts because they're not making money um, it's just terminating some sort of features like features are aren't making the money like uh, say the community page or the story setting that you can see on mobile stuff like that right so any setting any like features are on their website they think it's like anything like um, bad or anything like if it's not making them enough money they will terminate it but in the last sentence it says it will not um, it will not um, harm like any careers or any new viewers in any new way now I was watching a video uh, where uh, this guy was explaining it I can't remember who his name was I am sorry um, but he was explaining it and that got him a bit curious that last sentence and I can't remember why but um, I feel like it's mainly because of the fact that like um, in new ways it says like maybe there's new ways where your channel can get terminated after this update so yeah, so that's why I was originally going to post a video yesterday talking about if my channel could get terminated or not and uh, if I would move to Mix or not because I was honestly thinking about that boys. I was honestly thinking about that. That's still on my list though but I'll talk about that at the end of the video. So yeah, that's basically kind of the good news and now we go to like the really bad news. So right now I'm playing Call of Duty as you see here but recently um, basically uh, governments have been like on YouTube's case uh, and basically they've sued them, well they've not sued them as in where the, uh, the website's going to shut down. They've uh, done it to the point where like, um, they could like basically, um, they've basically gave them a fine, they've given them a fine of like, so much money, and uh, it's mainly because of like, what children are watching and stuff. Any children under 13 is like, not good for them. And uh, basically, now we need to put age restrictions on all of our videos. So that hurts our viewers in a new way. That hurt like that hurts our viewers in a new way. If you think about it, because like I know like loads of people out there who just watch COD even if they're not at the age of eighteen. Like even like people saying Call of Duty is like. Like, I play zombies like I play zombies all the time, and um, honestly, I enjoy myself on zombies, and, um, but the thing is, though, if I need to start going family friendly to keep this channel up, I honestly will, but the thing is, though, is that, like, this channel, I will need to put an age restriction on. I will need to put an age restriction on this video, literally, because, like, they'll be, like, saying, alright, what would you rate this video? So, I don't know, I probably need to rate the same age as I am, but literally, um, I don't know what I'm going to do for COD videos, I don't know what I'm going to do for COD videos, I probably will still stream and like do COD videos, but like, it, it won't be like as uh, the same people that would watch my COD videos, depending on what age they are, they could get an age restriction saying, no, sorry, this is age restricted, this isn't my choice, I, like, this is YouTube's choice saying that, the fact that they have to put on an age restriction, so yeah, so actually the only games I can like properly play that are like, family friendly are either Fortnite or Minecraft and I'm mainly going to play Fortnite like I haven't played Minecraft in ages and I'm honestly thinking about going back to Minecraft going to my old world but the thing is so uh, Fortnite's just at that point where it's like it feels like good again and stuff so I might also start doing Fortnite like again daily but um I don't know man like this is still worrying me and now my goddamn bar dogs are barking my dogs are barking give me a sec lad. Okay, right, we're back. Um, YouTube's terms of service can possibly change um, on December 10th. And um, I don't know if channels still can get terminated. I looked at um, a wee small channel with like 86 subscribers. And um, he basically said like um, that channels aren't getting terminated. YouTube just worded it wrong. Because uh, in the first sentence he said, 
Um, we're not going to terminate accounts because they're not making enough money. It's going to be certain features. But I'm thinking to that guy's video that I said earlier where he was worried about that last sentence. And I'm going to look at that video again and wonder and think and look at why he was worried about the sentence. But apart from that, that's all I can say. So basically, what I'm trying to say is, boys, um, on December 10th, something could happen to your channel whether like, they did say that or not. And um, you will need to put on age restrictions on basically every video saying, like, I saying, all right, what would you rate this video for ages, like all ages, or just a certain age? Honestly, I'll probably put mine at like 16 years old, like every single video, because like, honestly, there is analytics in a new, new uh, YouTube studio. Uh, it tells you like what um channel, uh, what your career's ages are, and um, most of my subscribers are 18 to 24, and um, like. The sec the second most of my subscribers are like under eight under eighteen so but most of my subscribers are eighteen to twenty four years old. So there's that. But apart from that though, I honestly don't know what I'm gonna do. If eventually like if something comes up in the next two weeks where my channel could possibly still get terminated, which I don't think it will, seeing as like uh, they did say that in their tweet saying that they're not gonna terminate channels. But the thing is though, I'm just saying if they do, if like they bring it up in the next two weeks I'll probably just start streaming on Mixer, and then I'll let you guys know on this channel, I'll put a video saying, hey guys, I'm now streaming on Mixer, so and so, so yeah. Basically guys, I just want to do a quick video here and there, um, I know I could have streamed today, but um, YouTube's really stressing me out to the point where, what the hell am I going to do? And um, honestly, I really have, I really do have full time to like, do YouTube right now, so yeah, but apart from that though, that's all I can say. My channel could possibly still get terminated. I'm not fully sure, but um, I will look into it again just to double check. Basically, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please subscribe, leave a like, click the notification bell, also to the channel, share this live stream with friends on any social media. And I'll see you all in this video live stream, boys. And goodbye. Night, baby girl. Trust me, that is all I need. Yo, I'm still in your hotel.